Yo, 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 what is going on Amiibo Army? We are back with a brand new sparkly raid boss. As you can tell, Naruto is today Greninja, as some people might know him, is the raid boss of the day. Oh boy, he's going to be a little speedy boy. He's going to be dropping, well, instantly on people's heads. They're not going to see it coming. He's going to be annoying. I think that's the best. And yeah, no, that's just the best way to describe him. So we see his stats. He's aggressive. 2100 attack and defense. It's to drop and move speed. You want to see how annoying he's going to be? Well, why don't we just go to the arena right now? Oh, the Elite Four has begun. Or I guess you got to take the gym challenges before you get to the Elite Four, right? Greninja is your first gym test and going to be the only gym test of the day. No one's getting to the Elite Four today. Brew Ninja, man, I'm kind of excited to see how this one goes, right? Obviously, with the support spears we gave him, the insta drop. Oh, yeah, Greninja's been able to, during training, I should say. Obviously, you guys didn't see the training because I didn't make a video on that. But during training, he was able to make some very good use. Oh, look at the back air. Look at the back air. Oh, he whips on the final smash. That's okay. That's okay. He might get a chance for another one. But, uh, yeah, with the support spirits that uh, Naruto has today, insta-drop, and I just made him even faster because why not? That's kind of annoying. <laughs> this Greninja, he's, uh, he's, he can string some things together with insta-drop. We can see him uh, do it with uh, some of his smash attacks, uh, tilt attack he can do at uh, low percentage. So it's cool the way he combos it into things, which is why I felt like it was at least a worthy addition for the character. So we got to see how it plays out overall, but so far he's looking good. I mean, he's got an entire one whole stock for the entire video so far. Okay, there's number two. Oh, he's going to know your power this time. He's got it. Is this going to be enough for at least a stock? No, Greninja's still at 66%. Ah. See, Greninja's actually pretty decent. Greninja's already a fast type of character. Greninja's got pretty decent recovery overall. And his smash moves are not bad at all for getting KOs, right? Like, the character... Oh, that happened. Ah, Bacon Mutt. What's up, buddy? Bacon's able to make this week's raid boss. I think he's the one that uh, just missed out last week, but uh, that's good. Oh, look at that. Look at, look at the water starters battling it out here. All right, which one's... Which one's more iconic, Gen 1 with Squirtle or Greninja? Isn't Greninja technically like one of the most popular Pokemon of all time? So I guess that kind of makes him like the most popular water starter by default then? Kinda? Yeah, at least I think so. I haven't checked a popular Pokemon poll in a long time, but I have to admit- Oh, what the heck was that? Did he just use- He just used his, uh, what the heck is that move? It's his like down special. Charizard could use another down special to help recover. Oh, no! Ivysaur is like, bro, leave me alone. Leave me alone. I just get a final smash. Greninja's like, I don't care. I'm not going to let you use it. Triple finish. Is this going to be enough for a stock? I think so. There you go. Bacon's on board. Bacon is on the board. He has struck, I guess, third technically, but he's still here. He's on. He's ready to go. Greninja. Greninja's so fast, dude. I don't know why I chose... I don't know. I, I have a thing with, like, fast characters all of a sudden. Well, not all of a sudden. I did that for Sonic back in, what was that, Season 3, I think? Where I take fast characters for raid bosses and then make them even faster. Because I just think it's funny. Because it's like, they're already fast. Why do they need to be faster? Because it's just annoying and aren't raid bosses. Isn't that, like, the point? They're supposed to be very strong and very annoying. So, oh, my God. Greninja, chill. The footstool, too. This dude's disrespectful. Well, check this out. We got a new person in the arena. Hammer Man. I was kind of hoping that he would have played like King Dedede or something just based on the name, right? Or Ice Climbers. To bring the hammer. But we got a Pac-Man. You don't see a lot of Pac-Man, right? We had a, we did have a raid boss, Pac-Man, who for the most part did decently. It wasn't the greatest, but still did pretty decently. So now we get to see a human player try out pac Oh, maybe, uh... Needs an extra life after that one. Oh, the final smash. He's got it. He's gonna... One more? No! Oh, if he could... Oh, he got that one. Oh, if he could have caught Greninja a little farther off stage with that, 
He could have had that, man. He could have had an early stock right there. Grenadier is only at 47%. That would have KO'd. Again, Pac-Man's placement. That's the big thing. We all know this with Smash Game. Party brawlers like this. Placement for your attack. No! Hammerman missed the trampoline. Oh. I mean, it happens to the best of us. I've done it plenty of times. Oh, no. Greninja. He's going in for the final kill. He's going in. He's got the final smash. He's ready to go. Nope. He activates it, but he, never mind. Greninja just like, you know what? I don't even need the final smash. Somehow, I'm just doing too well that... I don't need this extra move, right? Just get it out of here. So he just activates it whenever he feels like it. I don't think he's even connected a successful Final Smash yet. At least not that I remember. We've only had a few matches, but I don't think he's connected one yet. And I guess he... Oh, perfect timing! He hits a couple of these. He should have a KO. Beautifully done, Hammer Man. He got a stock with the Final Smash. Nicely done. That was the way he avoided. Greninja was about to finish... Hit, yeah, he was about to finish him off with that earlier, but... Oh, Sir Farts a lot. Wario. I like this. We seen a Pac-Man. We seen what? Didn't we see him? I think there was a Meta Knight in here earlier. See now a Wario. We're getting characters that we don't see. The variety is spectacular today. On a scale of 1 to 10, it's like at a 15. Beautiful. I love it. The variety. You never know. That's that's why I like variety more than anything. Greninja. Oh, yeah. His recovery is fine. I don't know why. I was like, oh, my gosh. He's down at the bottom of the blast zone. Wario tried to imitate that for some reason, and uh, it didn't really, <laughs> it didn't really go as well as Greninja. Uh, yeah, you don't have the exact same uh, recovery distance as him there, buddy. <laughs> oh, he missed the Wario, man. Ah, that could have been clutch. Well, kind of damage-wise, it could have been good, but no, was that a Wario waft? He, he used a tiny waft. Oh, that tiny waft. That's just gonna get somebody like wave their hand over their nose like twice. You know, just be like. Ooh, what's that smell? And then it's like, that's gonna be the end of it. No, you wanna build up that waft. You want that waft to clear out the entire arena. You wanna be like, yeah, that was me that did that. I'm the one. I am the one who did that. I, I guess, what's that old saying? If you smelt it, you dealt it. And a well, warrior definitely smells it after he deals it because, I mean, come on. How are you not gonna smell that? Oh, finally! Finally, we get to see the final smash. That's probably it for Wario 2, unfortunately. Yeah, he just bounced him so hard. Oof. Wow, another new person. Let's go. All right, so Spider Shroom, like I just said, brand new. But they were just saying, literally just saying in Discord, they're like, hey, there might be a little bit of lag on their part. So hopefully there's no lag and we just get a nice clean matchup. But, you know, if lag happens... Uh, it, it happens, unfortunately. Not much you can do about it, but we're just here to have a little bit of fun, enjoy ourselves, and look at this. Like what I was saying with the last match, which I never really got to finish, or maybe that was two matches ago. The variety of characters that we're seeing today. Now we get to see a snake, and we don't see anybody ever play snake, in these arenas at least. So that is so good. That's This is why I like variety. You never know who's going to show up with what kind of character, and then you never know how good that person is with said character. Greninja can shield forever, but um, yeah, you're going to get hit by those eventually. That only did like 13% damage. Is that stupid crazy? Like in a bad way? Yeah, that's kind of weird. Greninja, you're not that You're not that thick. You're not that thick. Thick Ninja. Grin Thicka. Grin, I, I, I don't know how to put thick into his name, but you get where I'm going. <laughs> Greninja now I'm playing around. He's just like, you know, I'm here. I'm here to defend my gym. Like, this is the first gym of the day. Okay, technically it's not the first gym. What raid boss is this? Is this like, this is like the 12th or 13th raid boss of season five. So this is like the 12th or 13th gym. So yeah, usually there's only eight gyms in Pokemon. So if we're on the 12th or 13th gym, this is going to be a really hard gym to try to defeat, right? The the amount of experience, the, the level cap that this... Whoa! How did... What the hell? The way... The way that Greninja went into the Final Smash. What? I swear he times this on purpose. Zack does this all the time. Right as the arena's about to end, then he wants to show up. He does this all the time. It's almost... I swear he does that on purpose. Or maybe it's a coincidence. Every time. <laughs> Either way... Zack makes it into the arena. He's going to try out 
this mega evolved level 9 billion Greninja Naruto, who's done pretty well today overall. We'll see how he finishes off though. We'll see if uh, anybody else is able to join. So I guess technically, if I look at it this way, since Zach joined right before the closing, uh, I guess it keeps it open. So if anybody else wants to join, you know, after this, then I guess that's a positive thing, right? You gotta look at, you gotta look at it in the positive. Ooh, the insta drop paying dividends. I mean, why wouldn't it? Insta drop is annoying to try to deal with. He ain't good. Oh, he actually hit the final slide. That's only like the second one he's hit, so. I don't know if it really matters in the end, but. I didn't get the KO. Didn't get the KO. This is DK. DK is a heavy character. He could he could withstand a few hits, right? He could withstand something like that. No problem. No problem. He's DK. He's the king of the jungle. And you know him well. He's the leader of the bunch. Anybody ever learn more than like the first two or three lines of the DK rap? I don't think I ever did. And DK's kind of angry about that. That's why he wanted to get this. <laughs> he went crazy on the stock right there. But he's at 94%. Does he have enough? Does he have enough left in the tank to pull off another? Well, I was going to say another, but you can't really have another if you don't have one. Can he get a stock? Can he get then another stock after that and lead to a win? I don't know. The, the match isn't over yet. How, how could I answer a question that's about the future? I'm not a psychic. Neither is Greninja. He's a water type. And isn't he like dark or something? Yeah, I think he's water dark. It's been a while since I played Pokemon. It's been a wow. He actually chased you that far. Greninja, you're crazy. And would you look at that? Voro is back again this week. Voro's able to make it into the arena before we shut it down. What's up, Voro? The resident Squidling. Squidling? No, Squidling's not a Pokemon. Which Pokemon am I thinking of? I don't know. Smeargle, that's the one. That's the one I was thinking of, Smeargle. The one the, the, the artist paints with his tail. I think Dempsey na nicknamed uh, his uh, inkling Smeargle, so that's kind of clever. I like that nickname. But, oh no! Uh, you're gonna, no? Are you gonna, you're just gonna walk into it? I mean, easy to avoid, but I guess it's easier to jump back into the Final Smash. That's, uh, <laughs> that's a thing too. Does he have a fun, no, I thought Greninja had a Final Smash. He's not even close on a Final Smash. He's close to getting a second stock on Voro, though. Is it gonna happen? Oh, nope, not yet, not yet. Those water knives, those water blades, whatever they are. Ooh, the back air! Oh, Greninja's so good in the air. He's so good in the air. Oh, what the heck? How did you, he, what? He pulled that off? Okay. I guess annoying is like the perfect way to go for a raid boss, right? If you want him to be really good, like slap on Insta Drop. Look what happens. <laughs> but I believe that's only the that might only be the second raid boss that I've had that has Insta Drop that's went undefeated. Jigglypuff was the other one because Dirty Bird lost, Joker's lost, Game and Watch lost. No, Ban Banjo, Banjo. Okay, that's the third raid boss with Insta Drop. Either way, Insta Drop's annoying, so it it has good content at least either way that is it for this one i do hope you guys enjoyed thank you to everyone who showed up we had quite we had a few new people this week so that was always good to see uh but uh yeah like i said that's gonna be it uh if you want your teas well here it comes this one's for you doc 